Hey, what's up guys? It's Jace Norman. I'm here at 17.com telling embarrassing stories with emojis. Let's do it. I don't even remember my dreams. Let's see if I can remember. Okay, uh, it involved poop and me lying about the poop, if that makes any sense. And then, uh, and then uh, I died in the end. So, yeah, it's a nightmare. I uh, didn't know it was school picture day, so I just was wearing like casual clothes and I usually don't um, do, I usually like, wake up like five minutes before school and just kind of rush to school, so it was pretty bad. I don't know what emoji would represent that, probably uh, uh oh no, no, maybe this. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. it was kind of like awkward. Probably sending the wrong emoji. Um, like, so you know how you have the recent emojis and like you send them? I probably would send this when I meant to send like, I don't know, something like this but thumbs up. So uh, that's usually awkward, especially if it's a girl. Because uh, these days, just randomly like saying a girl's hot is not necessarily the way to go. But it all, it's all good, you just gotta say, so it wasn't me, it was my friend, stole my phone. So uh, yeah, we're good. <laughs> my first kiss was probably like this. I don't even want to talk about it. <laughs> you know, these days it's kind of hard to tell if you're actually on a date or not. So probably like when one person thought it was a date, so I don't mean I gotta do the emojis, this. One person thought it was the date, but really wasn't a date. So they're embarrassed. I've definitely been in that situation before. My first detention, I was talking a lot. I used to talk a lot in class and uh, kind of make fun of my teachers. Wasn't the best kid um, in the world, but now I don't go to school anymore. So that worked out for me. Probably, I used to uh, take like weird selfies. I mean, I don't really, they really have this, like weird selfies of myself um, and print them out on paper. And then I would just knock on Cooper Barnes's door and just have this, the paper just laying out there and I would just leave and just have him uh, just see the weird selfie. So like, I would just take a picture of me doing something weird or the whole cast doing something weird. And then uh, we would just put the photo right on the floor, knock on the door and leave. So that was pretty fun. Emoji-wise, I felt mucho. But I'm, but I'm sure Cooper felt like this. Yeah, I mean, like the uh, the, the superhero costume in Henry Danger is like a constant um, ma maintenance. So uh, there's been a lot of bad situations with the costume, and uh, like I mean, th literally, like I'll, my costume just falls off of me. Like, so there's, there's a person's job who's literally their job is to be on set and to keep the costume on my body. So uh, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of mishaps with that, but luckily that's why you got the magic of television. Our production team and our crew is amazing. The most embarrassing thing I've ever said in front of a crush. Like my new movie, Blurt, that comes out February 19th on Nickelodeon. Um, it was probably, I don't know, I feel like you kind of Maybe you misread someone's personality, so you say something that's like super embarrassing, and uh, and they're just like, and you think you think you're funny because you you think you're funnier than you actually are, and so you say something that you think is funny, and they just don't get it at all. So then you just look like an idiot. idiot. The craziest stunt I've ever pulled was probably um, there's we had to. Uh, we were shooting an episode in outer space and I had to uh, float, uh, float in uh, <laughs> outer space and uh, kind of the whole, it was like a 10 hour shoot and I was just kind of going like this. By the end of it, I felt like, like this and this, uh, but it was fun. I love doing stunts. My texting pet peeve is uh, when someone does like the, they start typing and they go the dot, dot, dots and you're like, oh, what are they gonna say? And then they just don't reply back. So then you know, like, they for sure were gonna say something, but uh, they just leave you on red. That, or probably like saying K. 
I remember Ariana Grande. No. Well, yes, that. And but uh, Drake Bell from uh, from Drake and Josh came to uh, set to visit us because Dan Schneider and he did uh, the shows, and it was just the weirdest experience because he was just kind of giving me notes and ideas about the show, and it's like, dude, I just want to be you when I get older. <laughs> that was just really trippy because he's just there and he's just a, he's just a normal guy. And um, he's, he was gonna direct some episodes and stuff, so you just kind of get to know him really well. All right, guys, that's it for me, telling embarrassing stories with emojis. Thanks for tuning in. Tune in to the Adventures of Kid Danger um, on Nickelodeon every Friday at 6.30, and uh, subscribe to the 17 YouTube channel. See ya.